Okay, this is the hotel that we just checked in at Sujo. Here's the room with the beds. It's got a TV. Let me show you something that I just can't stand. It's better than the last one, but look at this. This is the bathroom. <laughs> the door is made out of glass. And you know what? On the outside, I control the lights. Where's the light? Oh, whoops. Yeah, in there. Okay, and another thing too, if I want to, for one, I can put, I can kind of put my finger into the door a little bit, you see? It's not lockable. And if I want to, if I really want to, I can just look at the top of the glass. Through the top of the glass, look inside. There's the shower. Where's the toilet? Where's the toilet? Anyway, you understand what I'm trying to say. I hate having the feeling that people can look in if they want to. There's our hotel somewhere over there. Here's two guys looking at me. Here's a bridge. It's supposed to be a temple somewhere over here. Here we are in downtown Suzhou. Buildings. More buildings. And a giant big screen TV in the middle of the town. We just went underground and came up, and you know what? There's more Sujo. One of the worst jobs. This poor girl is just clapping and clapping and yelling at people. Saying, please come in, please come in, please come in. I just noticed this, but if you look, every light has KFC on it. It is everywhere and unescapable. You cannot get away from KFC. There it is. There it is. Where's the next one? There it is. Let's see how far I can zoom. Once again, it's another KFC. And there's a Pizza Hut over there. Guess what? There's another KFC. These people are crazy about KFC. No wonder they think that's all that we eat. Guess what I just found? I found a bus dedicated to KFC. It drives people around this place. We're in Suzhou. We're in a tourist group. Here's our guide. I don't know what he's saying. I got a cold. We're looking at stuff. This guy stops in front of a tree and explains what it's there for. Stops in front of this stuff, explains what it's there for. Kind of wish I could just walk past the boring parts. But I have a feeling, just a feeling, that. <clears throat> okay, I thought it was all going to be boring by following the tour guide, but I got to break off. So that's good. Now, uh, the Chinese people, most of them live out in the city where it's loud, so the things that they like to go to to admire are the serene and quiet surroundings of these kinds of places here. There's mosquitoes in this garden! It's a temple. Okay, people said that this building right here was famous because it looks like a tiger. But if you ask me, it kind of looks like something else. Walked up a few hills. Got to the tower. 
Can we go inside? No. We can't? Oh, we're at the Silkworm Factory. Here's some bottle of silkworms and some silk, some silk spinners. You know what? It's August, and Santa Claus is still on their door. But Santa Claus is everywhere you go, all seasons. You cannot escape the claws. Han Shan Si. Han Shan. Han Shan Si. Place reminds me of the other temple that we were at just the other day. Look around. Yes, sir. It's good. Got the other dudes over here. I guess they're like personal golden bodyguards. And then what you got over here? We got somebody else. Your incense deals. You can buy some incense for probably like five or ten bucks. And you got these red ribbons. You can buy some red ribbons, hang them on there, put your name on it, and hope that Boo will see it and do something about it. Okay, let me explain. This is like a pearl company or something where you can buy lotions, you can buy pearls, you can buy all kinds of things made by clams or something with shells. And we're part of a tour group right now, so this guy takes us along to show us different temples, show us different attractions, but then also to these places where we can buy stuff. I'm pretty sure he works for the guys too. Getting on a boat, getting on a boat. There we go. Oh, well. Ooh. That water is level with my seat. Got your sellers. All these people. Check out the tower. And guess who's there to greet you? The fattest clay Buddha I've seen in a, in a while. <laughs> Do you need help getting the cat out of that tree? Hmm? Check out Buddha. Again. We are at dinner, and we met up with some old friends. <laughs> They're trading us to um, a dinner at your brother's, yeah. your brother's restaurant. Yeah. Mm. This is Hu Bing Da Dao, nighttime in Suzhou. Out of nowhere, fire and light starts coming up. <laughs> Water spraying everywhere. That's crazy. This is where we just were five minutes ago when I was shooting the last video. You gotta realize nobody really expected this to happen. Guess where we are? We're in a KTV bar. And I don't know how to sing in Chinese. Thank you. 